All right, what's going on, you fam? For you in here. Happy Saturday. Nothing starts the day better than a little bit of Hollow Knight. Now, uh, what is it that I try to do? I think I forgot where I was trying to go. Uh, ch -ch -ch. I came all the way over here to buy stuff, but in hindsight, I don't really know where I'm going. I think, um, I think I need to take that elevator going. Wait, what's that? What's that beside Dirt Mouth? The uh, the head. Let's go there. What do we have here? I mean, we've seen this before. We've been here, but the icon changed. It's colored. The Black Egg Temple. Oh, there's nothing I can do here? Damn, I was curious. Alright, never mind then. Goodbye. Um... Where do I go then? Some of you told me to go back to the Mantis Village that I forgot something, so I'll be doing that as well then. I'll go back to the Mantis Village and see what I may have missed. I thought I cleared everything, but perhaps I forgot something and it'd be a good idea to go check. This is super interesting. So you know how when you go back to the beginning, you know where you start when you start the game? I went back there because I noticed with the Mantis handle, we can climb up the wall. And look, I found secret spots. I recently got a new token. I got this guy here. Fury of the Fallen embodies the fury and heroism that comes upon those who are about to die. When close to death, the bearer's strength will increase. Isn't that cool? I wonder where we are. This is a brand new area. Look at that. It seems I discovered a brand new map without really realizing it. But yeah, Mantis Handle going back to uh, where we started took us here. The thing is, is I don't really know where here is. But at, at least it's a new area to discover. We just need the map guy to start though. Yeah, where are we? Where did I take us? Look at the background art. Look at the cliff. It's just nothing but... Carcasses, shells. Well, that's a shame. Where are we? No idea. Is this supposed to be like a road to riches place? What is this? Definitely interesting, though. I I like it when games let you do this, you know what I mean? You start out the game, you think nothing of your beginning area, but if you go back and you're just careful, you find cool stuff. Like the map guy. About as far as he's willing to go. Look at that. This guy's giving me a beta version of his map, and I had still... Jeez... This is definitely where the lantern would be important. The 1800 coin one. I am. I get the sneaking suspicion that uh, a lot of dark areas will 100% require it. But that's so expensive. 1800. Does this man think I made of money? Unless the um, these little pockets of gold or coins rather are meant to be an answer to that. Because there's actually quite a few of them. It is a good thing we got the uh, the charm to collect our money. So I don't have to deal with this. You'll notice I lack money. Uh, I bought a soul vessel at the shop. That's why. I figured uh, soul is pretty important. This I don't get. I see this a lot. This weird orange slices tree thing. I wonder what it is. I wonder where we're going. Wonder where anything is. Hello, Dark Cavern. Where are we going? Us in here? Okay. <gasps> hey, buddy. See ya. 
I gotta visit that guy again. Wait, no! I've been here before. This must be nothing special. Ah, oh, no! I lost the location of where I just was. That's a shame. I gotta get... Ah, oh, I lost it. What the hell? Oh, come on. How did we get back here? Um, where exactly was the, uh... Oh, you know what? At the bottom left there, I wonder if that's where the, the bouncy mushrooms were. I remember not really understanding what I needed to do. I also think there's a, uh, the, one of those glass worm children things are near here, so I may as well complete that too, because why not? For the sake of completion. Just to get everything done. Oh god. Ugh, I'm not about fighting you two. I hate fighting those guys. Them and their annoying set pattern of fighting. Wait a minute. This is my first time having a dash. I wonder if there's anything at the end of the lake. Oh god, the, the exploration uh, aspect of the game is coming out in full force now. Alright, here's that area. Let's see now. Let's see if we have the answer. So this guy doesn't follow me, does he? Yeah, if we have the mantis handle... Is this guy to get me a boost? I wonder. Damn it. I guess there is no way. Can I aggro this guy too? No. Here we go. So here's an area I was also stuck. But now I have an answer to. Mantis handle was the only way to be able to get over here. So what do we got? Oh. All right, a new area. What do we got? What do we have? Hello, hello new thing to discover? What is this? Surely there's more for you to offer besides just a ton of soul. That's so strange. Just out here? That's what this map is for? Just a ton of soul? And some money? No way. There's got to be something else around here. What could I be missing? area has to have more use than just that. Okay, I think we found it. Hello? What do we got? Whoa. Oh my god, it's a spooder. Oh my god. Whoa! Well, damn. No, controller. Dude. Controller, please. Can we not do this at the most important moment? I don't know where the bench, my bench is. All right, here we go. If there's one thing I absolutely despise, it's backtracking. Not in the sense of exploration, like in Metroid games, but when you die, you get tossed like... 40 maps behind and you gotta repeat yourself. I, I hate that stuff. Get back your shade. You got work to do. Alright, Spooder, you got saved by my goddamn controller last time, but not this time. 
I didn't realize my pick could clash with his claw. Gotta find an opportunity to heal. Okay. What the hell? Okay, after dying to that boss the second time, I decided to look for a bench that was nearby so that I wouldn't have to go through all of Green Path in order to come back. But look! There are people here. Hello? Oh, I can't talk to them? Well, at least we're able to do that. That's nice. Um... That's whatever. This is so strange. I, I like that though. I like it when developers implement these like really minor additional details for no reason at all. I mean, they they didn't have to include the fact that two additional people show up on that uh, little area to swim, but they're like, hey, I, we think it'll add a little bit of extra to the uh, to the story, so why not? Dude, my controller is just running about. This is so frustrating sometimes when your controller does this. Just drifts, just continues drifting. Imagine getting close to finishing that boss and your controller says, how about no? I think I'd prefer if we died this time. I guess now I know the answer for this guy being here. This is a boss. Uh, is there anything to the left? Just double checking, no. Where's my shade? Come on, buddy. We got, we got work to do. The spider's definitely tough. It's, uh, so, I know the attack pattern is just... Yeah, this... The spider just doesn't give you any time to... Breathe! My controller is not responding. Dude, it, so this is what happens. The controller does its last input, but doesn't disconnect. So if I move to the right and the controller goes haywire, it'll just keep moving to the right. It'll just keep doing the last known input. Now look, I'm about to die. <sighs> this is so frustrating. It's really starting to get on my nerves. Look, it's not even, it's not even responding correctly as I try to go through the menu. Look, I'm not even pressing anything. What is this? All oh, right, couple things. One, uh, I fixed the controller issue. I have decommissioned the PS4 controller. Set up the PS5 one. Uh, the only thing I'm worried about is in the odd chance it ruined the recording. Um, the PS5 controller has its own speaker, which uh, by default changed some of the audio settings. I switched them back, but just in case. And two, I switched my charms. I decided I'm going to go for this little shaman stone to do some extra damage with the spells. I think that'll be pretty damn helpful for this fight. We won't have a handicap anymore, thank God for that. So, a little spooter. Meet your match. Alright, all I gotta do is watch for... It's claws, really. Yeah. And then that's an opportunity to strike. Whoa. I didn't expect him to go for two. That's new. Ah, I didn't draw him high enough. So I can get three hits in if I'm quick enough. Whoa. Disgusting spooter. I really how uh, I'm curious as to how much stronger my spell is now. But the shaman stone? Woo! Because uh, this booter is definitely painful. There we go. Stupid spider. When I have no handicap, you are nothing but light work. Well, 
What is this? Gimme. Another shard. I'm going to assume it's like the uh the hearts for the from Legend Zelda. Alright, epic. Let's find our wait a minute. That boss wasn't even an important boss. Wasn't really relevant towards anything. It was just uh, just something to fight. Okay. I know where there's a bench, so we can head on over there. And then I'm wrapping this episode up. We haven't really... Wait a minute. Now that I think about it, did we even accomplish anything here? I don't think so. We discovered a new area, but that's about it. Hmm. It would seem we have much to do next time. Alright, it's just because I'm, I'm short on time. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And until next time. Next time we'll make some significant progress. Peace.